So now that we've made that beautiful light shine out the projector, the solar system itself looks a bit crap. So we're going to add some effects to that to make that look better as well. So the first thing we're going to do is just click on the sun, and then we're going to open the hypershade. Any second now, come on hypershade, you speedy mofo. There we go. Right, I'm just going to clear my work area, and then this little um, icon here graphs the materials on the selected objects. If I click it, it will show me the material um, that is currently on the sun. And here you can see the options for um, the sun material. Now at the moment, in your property editor, you're currently using something that's called the Look Dev Preview, uh, which comes with a lot of the most common um, options, but not all of them. So we're going to change that by changing to, which button is it? That one. So toggle between Look Dev View and Attribute Editor View. So if I give that a click, basically this window changes a little bit, but we've got some more options. And if we scroll down, we're now going to get a special effects section. I'm going to expand that, and there's a glow intensity. And I'm going to turn the glow intensity up to 0 0.5. Okay, now this is a post-processing effect that's going to make the sun look super A. So if I do another test render of that particular scene, you'll now see that the sun itself is looking much better because it now looks like it's emitting its own light, which gives a much nicer effect. 